How y'all doing? 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 doing? Thank you guys so much for joining Tierra's Turbo. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. This video be for all my beautiful and my handsome. Okay, Libras out there. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Keep in mind that this is a gentle reading, so it's not going to resonate with everyone. So please take the parts that does resonate and what does that leave it on out. Also, this could be the past, the present, or the future. And to be aware of any scammers in the comment section pretending to be me. Libra. I don't know what's going on here, but there is a karmic that is in your energy that is wanting to take some type of a risk. When it comes to you, like whether that be reaching out or, you know, just popping out. And I'm not getting like, oh, a karmic to a third party or something like an ex that you dealt with. But this person is coming out as a karmic individual by far. That's just who they are, a karmic. This person, whoever this karmic may be, they're thinking about taking some type of a risk towards you. Okay, is what I'm getting here. Because something here is ending, is what I'm getting here. And somebody is, they feel like something is over between you and them. But this is somebody that low-key adores you and admires you in some type of way. But they're feeling alone or they feel like you have left them, you know, kind of on the sidelines or I don't know. Like they just feel like something is final between the two of y'all, okay? Okay. But this person feels like, I don't know, maybe you feel like they're poison. okay? This person could be lost as well in space, I'm getting. For some of y'all, people could say, what you doing? Where are you? Not you, but them. Like, this person is just basically out of focus is what I'm getting here. Because this person is very toxic or they have very toxic traits is what I'm getting. Okay, something about the behavior or something about the people that they are around all the time. Okay, is what I'm getting here. But now this person feels lost about what happened. Okay, about why something is over between the two of y'all. But the thing about it is, it's like you are being protected from this person for a reason. You probably don't even know what the fuck really going on. Okay, but your spirit guys already gave you some type of a heads up whatever situation that this is okay but there's somebody that feel like they they on the verge of confessing something to you like i'm getting like spirit or your archangel michael is pushing this person to tell you something so for some of y'all this person wants to have some type of conversation with you is what i'm getting maybe this is the risk reaching back out to you or reaching out to you okay because this person is starving because they're thirsty for motherfucking information for some of y'all, but like I said, this person is coming out as a karmic, okay? And this is right now in the present. Somebody is feeling this way, okay? Maybe some of you just stay where you used to stay or you're not in that old town, community, or whatever it may be, okay? But somebody feel like they want to come over for whatever reason. Who is this person? Give me some more information, spirit. Like somebody wants some type of, yeah, unity or closeness, okay? But you may have a boundary set with this person. Like I said, for some of you, for some particular reason, who is this person? Why does Libra have a boundary with this person? Because somebody got an epiphany about this person, okay? Somebody did some type of self-reflection, okay? But somebody want their damn... Questions answered is what I'm getting. Who else got that? I forgot. Book. Okay. Yeah. Is what I'm getting here. Yeah. Then we got here wishful thinking. Mm, second chance. Deja vu nostalgia. Somebody has wishful thinking that they could come back and spin a block for some of y'all in whatever way that they may be. After running away from you, okay? Or something like that. What's going on? Yeah, we got here thrills. Mm -mm. Yeah, that's why I said toxic as hell. Whoever this person is, Libra. Okay, they always going through a certain cycle, never changing. Same shit, different day. Okay, this person could even be battling some type of addictions for some of y'all. 
okay? Or they just always made bad decisions in life. It's just like they can never stay stable. And you don't want to be around somebody like that, okay? Whether that be a behavior pattern, okay? Whether them not being able to, you know, just stay afloat in life, pay their bills, okay? Just even have the simple common sense and empathy for others or whatever it may be, okay? Yeah, we got here sweet talk. It's like, no, they get the gap shit ain't working on you. Okay, we got here under pressure. So somebody feel like they want to come in and be very sweet. You know what I'm saying? Sound sweet, sound innocent. So that maybe you would trust them and feel willing to open up. Okay, it's what I'm getting. Yeah, this is what I'm... But Oh, we got here too late. But there's something that's too late. Okay, yeah, because this person can't trap you. It's what I'm getting here. It's like, yeah. Yeah, we got here 200. Yeah, my baby's playing outside, upstairs. Yeah, for some of y'all, woo child, we got here a twin flame. And then we got here love spell. Woo child. Mm. Mm. So you could have had a masculine here that was doing some type of love spells on you here, Libra. Okay, this definitely could be, um, or this could be, a, I don't know, or there was a feminine energy. Okay, they got the nerve to try to take some type of risk towards you. Okay, or this could, you know what I'm saying? Or if this is a karmic, this could be a karmic, okay? For some of y'all that did love spells in your twin flame union, okay? That's for some of y'all. Others of y'all, yeah, she got you guys to divorce. Like, I'm getting, this woman took some type of risk or a gamble to play with the twin flame connection, whoever this feminine energy is, for whatever reason, okay? Yeah, Backstab. I'm telling you, for some of y'all, this is the chick that tried to backstab you or deceive you, okay? Made this masculine play games with you, okay? Whatever, like, I'm getting like a homeworker energy or whatever. It may be, but at the end of the day, you ain't lost shit. They did. But anyway, okay, Libra, because I don't know what the hell this is, okay? Cause somebody's in pain from somebody cheating on them or something like that, okay? Yes, yeah, says I miss you. So there's somebody that miss you, somebody that... They feel like a jackass. Okay, Libra. Mm. I'm also getting for some of y'all. Oh, my God. Some of y'all, somebody could be wanting to reach out to a friend. Okay. You could be the friend or whatever like that. Somebody may want to reach out to a friend or something. Okay. And they want to tell them. Because maybe they thirsty to give out. You know what I'm saying? Information or something of that nature. Maybe they want to vent to somebody. Maybe they trust you. Put it where it fits, okay? But I'm definitely getting there was somebody here that backstabbed you. There was a karmic that either came in between your marriage or relationship or whatever like that, okay? Is what I'm getting. They took a risk to do that. And this twin or whatever like that fell for it because they was underneath some type of fucking spell. Because they was already living some type of a toxic nightlife. Maybe they met this bitch when they was out partying or something, okay? They made bad decisions. They didn't think it through. You get what I'm saying? Like, what well, is best to stay home with your wife or whatever the situation may be, love. Okay, but somebody feeling stupid now. Yeah, we got here turning your back. But you are turning your back on somebody. Straight up. Yeah. And this person is all up in their feelings, honey. And fed up. Okay, because they want things their way. Wow, I'm glad you got away from them, okay, Libra? Because they're selfish as fuck. They're arrogant. They've got so much pride and ego. Pride before the fall. Mm -hmm. this, is, this is what it looked like here, okay? But yeah, they stubborn as hell. I see you could have blocked this person too. Like, you don't want them to call you, honey. Period, all right? Mm. Yep, karmic lesson. You learned your lesson from this person. You surely did. You surely did. You're, you're closing out this cycle, finally. You're closing out this cycle. Yeah, because you love yourself, period. Okay? You love yourself. I know that's right, honey. Yes. Ooh, and that cut of awaken your spiritual gifts. Maybe your twin. Okay, awaken your spiritual gifts, of course, because when you unite with your twin or what have you, like, don't be the worst type of relationship. Them twin flames. You go through the worst hell and the worst pain. Okay? But it's like it's supposed to awaken in you, okay? It's supposed to, you know, uh, push you into your purpose. You know what I'm saying? But you learned your lesson, okay? Period. You got out of that type of cycle. Yeah, we got here rejected. Okay, yeah, we rejected this person. Look at this shit. Because all they did was want a party. They got a toxic lifestyle. Like I said, it says toxic lifestyle, okay? Yeah. 
the cycle is over with. You're done. You're tired of partying. You're tired of drinking. Oh, you know, say so maybe you was, you know, at one point in time, it was fun. But you're getting older, okay? And therefore, you want to be more serious with your life or what have you. But they fucked up when they started to deceive you. Play these mind games with you and love bomb you and, you know, cheat on you, actually, for some of y'all, okay? It's what I'm getting. This person ain't shit. What else, spirit? Anything else? Four wands, yeah. You and this person could have been living together on any foreign roof, okay? Yeah, and you found out some information. You found out something about this person. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, we got here the King of Cups, okay? Cancer Pisces, Scorpio energy, or it's like you you love this person, or this person did have a lot of love for you. Put a word fist, or somebody here was trying to find some information about somebody. Okay, we got the moon card. Okay, Cancer Pisces energy. So some of y'all gonna be done with a Cancer or a Pisces energy. Okay, for some of y'all, or somebody was holding on to some type of a secret about a Pisces. Okay, they're gonna have Pisces right there. Or somebody was secretly jealous, okay, or secretly was in love with your person. I don't know, put a weird fucking fist. Cancer. I keep getting cancer or Pisces. Some of y'all dealing with a cancer or a Pisces. Okay, Capricorn energy with the devil card. Damn. There was a karmic that really tried to interfere with y'all situation. Like, bitch, the fuck? Obsessed with your man and what it looked like. Okay, yeah, not a pinnacle. Made this person bear crummy and shit. Or somebody was secretly jealous of a relationship building or moving forward. Put a word fits, okay? Yeah. I'm getting this man always thinks about you, though. They always think about you. This King of Wands, okay? Aries Bill Sagittarius. What's this uh, King of Wands? Queen of Cups. I don't know if he was dealing with a King Queen of Cups or what have you. Ooh, see, this person love your ass. I'm definitely getting that. Now we got here the Queen of Wands. What the hell? Queen of Wands, King of Wands, Queen of Cups, King of Cups. There was a bitch that was trying to pull a wedge between your relationships. Like I'm getting for some of y'all, there was a past relationship and then there's another relationship that you're dealing with now. For some of y'all, that's not for everybody, that part. Okay, so this King of Wands could be dating a Queen of Cups now. Okay, but he's still in love with you. Okay. Then there's a King of Cups that some of y'all could be dealing with. And this bitch is also, she been doing love spells on your man. An art of man that you try to deal with. Ugh, who the fuck is this bitch? Pisces energy. I keep getting this Pisces energy. But somebody is breaking free from the illusion. Is what I'm getting here. I'm getting all these men are. Put it where it is. Five of Pentacles. Three of Swords. Oof. One of them broke out the illusion and they asses is going crazy. And they want war with the man that she's with now. Damn. What kind of story is this? This is crazy. Okay, we got here the sun. Leo energy. Okay, five of cups. See, I'm, oh, this is so crazy. There's a man mourning over a woman. He still wants her. And then this woman, he still misses her. And then this woman could be dating somebody else. Okay? And he wants to fight this man for this woman. But there's also a karmic feminine. I'm getting a karmic feminine that was doing a love spell on your, your twin flame, your ex-twin flame. And now she successfully completed that cycle. She's trying to do it to a, a new situation. Is what I'm getting. So some of y'all, I don't know who the fuck this feminine energy is. Okay. Everybody came out but you. All right. Mm. Backstabbing motherfuckers. She couldn't even try to sleep with your past. Oh, y'all, this is crazy. 
This is crazy, honey. Yeah, but there's a situation here that's protected. So if some of y'all dating somebody now, that relationship is protected. She can't touch that. Okay, because your pet your ex flame was supposed to learn a lesson, but they didn't. Okay, it's what I'm getting here, Libra. They were supposed to learn that lesson from their past. Okay. The karmic or what have you. But they didn't. So you had to move on. You find somebody else. Now this person misses you. And it's this past uh, friend. She seemed like she. Or ooh, I don't know about friend. I was going to say friend. But that popped out. So it could be a friend or something like that. I don't know. Or a karmic bitch that just was dating. Okay your ex person. Your ex flame or whatever. Okay. Yeah. For some of y'all. Mm. Or she could have slept with him. What a word it is. Okay. Mm. Ooh, we scandalous, scandalous, honey. Is what I'm getting here for real. Mm. All right, but you are protected. Don't worry about that. Archangel Michael is protecting you, okay, from whoever this Jezebel is. You're definitely coming out as a Jezebel, okay? Mm -mm. But yeah. Ooh, child. But I love you guys, okay? Stay blessed. All right, the new situation is protected, so don't worry about it. Okay, damn, I'm just, I'm just, wow, you know what I'm saying, from whatever this is, that's crazy. Who would do or take that, you know, those steps to do that to somebody, like, honey, ooh, get it together, oof, but anyway, I love you guys, I'll see you guys in the next one, if you guys need anything else from me, look in the description box below, um, if you guys want to see more of my content, go check out my TikTok account, love you guys, bye.